Mad Dog, who do you think is the oh, best Magic, guard of all come time? Come on, uh, that's not even close. Magic Johnson is the only player who I've seen, there's only two or three of them, mm -hmm. who could dominate a game at that position without putting the ball in the basket. Curry doesn't score, he's not a factor. Magic can go in there, take two shots, and dominate a game. His rebounding, his passing, his fast break ability. Magic, he's 6'8", Magic Johnson, and I love Curry. And we all know he's a wonderful shooter, but he is not Magic Johnson. I'm sorry. Never, he's not in the same discussion. That is blasphemy to put him in Magic Johnson's category. Magic Johnson? Magic Johnson, you could argue, is a top three, four player in the history of the National Basketball Association. Magic Johnson, and again, what is the definition of a point guard? You know what the definition? Bob Cousy always used to say this, the great Bob Cousy. When you cross midcourt, your first objective is to get a teammate a good shot. Magic Johnson, when he crossed midcourt, his first objective was to get a teammate a good shot. Curry, in a lot of ways, his first objective is what 35-footer I can make. And that's nothing wrong with that. But that's different than being a point guard. Mm. Magic's job is to be a point guard. And I, one other thing, running a fast break, it's not even discussable. Curry, there's nobody, and I've watched this since 1960s, nobody ran a fast break in the NBA at that position better than him. And better than Magic. He rebounded the ball. He's six eight, not six two. He is six foot eight. Magic, Who, magic, six nine. So even better. Thank you, Steve. You helped my argument. It's listen. I love Curry not as much as he does, as we know, but there is nobody in the history of the NBA who is a better point guard. And he won five championships. Mm -hmm. And a college championship. Mm -hmm. Than Magic Johnson. Okay, let me say this because. We've made news because we had a list, and I talked about Matt, Steph Curry, maybe the greatest point guard ever, and all of this other stuff, okay? This is not a debate. I'm just going to educate the viewers out there just like Doggy just did. And I'm going I'm to tribute, I'm tribute this. I'm going to pay tribute to you, the historian that you are, to your colleague at uh, Mad Dog Radio, Eddie Johnson, who was filling in the morning. Good show. guy. He's very, very good. good guy. Excellent. Terrific NBA player throughout. I mean, he was giving lessons this morning on this very topic. Oh, he was. Good lessons. job, Steve. I didn't because see that. he was, a, yeah, yeah. He, he brought you up too. He didn't name you by name, but everybody knew who he was talking about, right? <laughs> and he was talking about you, and he was like, he said, because he knows his history. And Magic Johnson, he said, it's not even close. Magic Johnson's the greatest point guard in NBA history. Y'all don't know what y'all talk about, blah, 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 blah. And he was educating folks and uttered the word facilitator. And I'll get to that in a second. But before I do, I have to read you a text that I received this morning at 5.54 a.m. Good morning, sir. Although greatest of anything is always a debate, I beg to differ on greatest point guard of all time with what you said. Magic Johnson is easily the best point guard of all time. Steph Curry is very close but not in front of Magic. You must define point guard to really have a serious debate. Steph Curry is by far the best shooter of all time. Yes, his movement has created many shots for his teammates. He's a career 43% three-point shooter. But Magic Johnson invented the triple-double. Not true invented, but makes it more noticeable in terms of the impact on the game. It's a point guard stat, to be honest. Magic was the best. We can go on, but I don't want to take up too much of your time. I know you get the point. By the way, Magic has five NBA championships. Wow. That quote this morning well, at 545 was from Mr. Michael Jeffrey Jordan. Wow. How about and he, that? And he asked me. Wow. To, he asked me to read it on the air. He said, I'm not backing up for it. He said, I'm tired of this argument about Magic Johnson not being the best point guard in the history of the game. He is the best point guard in the history of basketball. That is from Michael Jordan. While I do agree with Mad Dog and Michael Jordan, the definitions, who's a true point guard, none of that should matter. In my book, you can be the greatest point guard of all time, averaging zero assists. If you play the point guard position and you're that good at basketball, you average 50, 60 points a game, and you win championships, then there should be no debate. Obviously, Magic Johnson is the better passer, but Steph Curry is the better shooter. Their play style or skill set isn't what makes them better. 
What makes them better is who's the better basketball player. Like Michael Jordan, I think Magic Johnson takes a very slight lead to Steph Curry. Magic Johnson has one more regular season MVP, two more finals MVPs, and one more championship. I know he had Kareem, but Steph Curry had KD for two of his four championships. In fact, if the Warriors lost to Boston, it wouldn't even be close. But since Steph Curry won that finals MVP, and that was by far his most impressive championship, no Kevin Durant, Klay Thompson wasn't at full strength, Steph was by far the best player on the court, averaging 31 a game. To me, that championship was more impressive than any of Magic's five. But I still give a slight edge to Magic Johnson for the overall consistency and how many more accolades he has. I think for these two, it's about as close as it gets, but let me know in the comments what you guys think. Is Steph Curry or Magic Johnson the greatest point guard of all time? And don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed this video and subscribe for more NBA content just like this. And I will see you in the next upload.